Are you ready? It's coming. DeSoto's biggest reading challenge ever. It is the DeSoto ISD Read Now Summer Challenge. How many books and modules can you read to earn points to win cool prizes? Each week, from June 12th through July 28th, prizes will be awarded for the top 10 students in grades K through 2, 3rd through 5th, 6th through 8th, and 9th through 12th. The prizes range from Six Flags, Hurricane Harbor season passes, earbuds, restaurant and movie gift cards, bicycles, Beats by Dre, and tablets. Stop by the Reading Challenge kickoff on June 8th at Woodridge Elementary from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. to find out more. So, what are you reading this summer? I would try to read chapter books because I really um, like the Million Word Club. I'm going to reread the Harry Potter series, all the whatever after series. Is. Why do you like to read? I, I like to read because it, it helps kids learn to read. Well, time seems to pass by faster whenever I read, and then I seem to enjoy any book I really choose. I like to read because I get to learn more things that I don't know. Sometimes it, the books that I read are interesting and they just, I read on my spare time. Well, it helps me learn about people's imaginations and like what they like to do. Because the more you read, the more you know. It's entertaining, it's interesting, and especially if you have the right book, it can be, it's interesting. What do you like to read about? Frog books. I like to read about scary and mystery things. I like the time travel and, and monsters. Tales of the Peculiar is from uh, Ramson Riggs. I like it because it's um, a, not a normal tale and it, you can't expect what you, what, uh, the ending. What is your favorite book? Actually be the series I just finished, the Percy Jackson series. Um, I would say Diary of a Wimpy Kid because the more you read it, you'll get into it and um, like they have a whole series of books. Uh, my favorite book is called Case Closed because uh, it's about this kid, he's a detective and he gets turned into a little kid. Because Amelia Bedelia always messes up things, she does the opposite of what they say. But um, the house on Mango Street is um, about a girl who's gro who grows up in Chicago, and she wants to find a way. She needs an outlet to express herself, so she writes. And so um, I love that book because um, it teaches me that was when I, no matter what's going on around me, there's always a way to find a creative outlet. Why is reading frequently important? As I read all the new books that I get, I can um, I can use those on vocabulary book. And it helps you with writing and all that other stuff uh, that's really important. If you don't eat a lot, then you won't grow and get stronger. And if you don't read a lot, then your mind won't like get stronger. Well, it helps you learn new words. Like when you go up, when you need help new words, you read and remember the words. In life, we, everything is about reading. You read on tags and you read numbers and that's just really important. So being able to use big vocabulary will help, you know, your job and everything. And um, if you don't know how to read, if you don't know how to read that good, you are not really going to accomplish anything in life. Do you prefer paperbacks, audio, or ebooks? I like regular books because you, you, could, you could actually read the books from from your own, from your hand. And paperback books because I can just sit in my bed and just read it. I like regular paperback books because I don't like people reading to me because they have to go slow and fast and I can't really understand. So I like reading them myself because I can understand myself. Regular paperback books because I find it easier for 
paperback books because I can actually see how things are with the books. To sign up, go to www.desotoisd.org slash read now. Hey, thanks for reading because a reader is a leader.